When the sun sets in South Irving, there is something new to see. We have new LED lights for all the uh, water sprays. And how is it going to be used for different holidays, different occasions? We've got several presets that are already put in for, for holidays, the colors that you associate with Fourth of July or Christmas. We have some latitude to change those for an event that might be once in a while. Uh, the fountain is a key focal feature for the heritage district here in downtown. So we're very conscious of that and we tried to expedite the project as quick as we could. It was not always easy. The teams involved had to track down the original plans. And we had diagrams, but the diagrams don't always equal what was actually done. This is definitely a little out of the box. This is a lot different than your average project. They ended up putting in a system that uses wireless technology. And the LEDs allow a wide range of color possibilities. Pretty much the spectrum. I mean, you're not going to get you know, dark colors like browns and maroons, but uh, anything in, in the visible spectrum. While the lights are the most noticeable change, the bigger one involves this building. You see the installation here in this video from a few months back. Now we're getting a look inside to see the fountain's controls. All of this used to be underground, where it was sometimes tough for the Parks Department to access. So now that you have this building, what kind of problems is that going to help prevent? Maintenance will be much easier. The biggest issue there was, though, that we were having flooding issues from time to time. And each time we would do that, we would have to change all of those components out, and it was quite expensive. Uh, we're going to see a lot less downtime with the fountain uh, in the future because we'll have a whole lot fewer mechanical issues. All of the work means the fountain that Irving residents have enjoyed for two decades and has become a downtown icon will be around for years to come. We were very pleased to hear from many of our patrons that they have kind of chronicled their life story through events that happened and are captured here with this beautiful fountain. And that made it an important project for all of them knowing it is an important spot to so many in this city. It's really neat to work on a project like this. Yeah, we were excited to work on it. Thomas Gandy for City Source.